Hi, Pratiksha. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, sir. How are you? I am doing good, sir. How are you? I am good. Thank you for asking. Pratiksha, Yes, sir. you are based out to which location? I am based out of Bangalore. Bangalore. Did you receive the job description from our recruiter? Ah, uh, yes, sir. Received. Okay. Why you, you know, what you find the best on the JD compared to your profile? Uh, as I have prior experience in data analysis and business and uh, business analyst uh, and data management reporting, the, those things I have done in my previous company. That's why I am interested in this profile. So you are feeling that uh, this profile will be very suitable for you? Yeah, uh, as my point of view, it is a perfect match. Perfect. Okay, good. So, uh, so me and the team want to understand more about to, about your education, your background, what your role and responsibility, your daily tasks. Can you be to elaborate, please? Uh, yeah, sir. It's my pleasure to introduce myself. My name is Pratiksha and I am from Bangalore. Uh, I have completed my uh, BTEC in electronics and computer electronics and communication engineering from ITR in the year uh, 2020. Then uh, coming to my work experience, I have 2.5 years of experience as a data analyst, uh, data management uh, reporting. Uh, and there I have used SQL, MS Excel, Tableau, PPT, and Python also. So then coming to my daily task, uh, I was involved in communicating with client and stakeholders of different managers to understand their business requirement uh, related to the data. Okay. Uh, then so I am well versed in Microsoft SQL Server also extracting uh, data, manipulating data from uh, different database where uh, I have used SQL joins. Then... Uh, SQL set operators, a uh, where clause I have used, uh, group by and having also. I have used road procedures, like ranking and building a uh, complex query. Uh, then I have a good knowledge in Microsoft Excel as well, where uh, I was working uh, to, uh, where I was working Excel to filter the data and did data validation, like conditional formatting I have done. Then I have used different Excel functions also, uh, Mm -hmm. uh, using different uh, using formulas like VLOOKUP or HLOOKUP. Uh, I have worked with uh, pivot tables, pivot charts, report and dashboards also. Uh, Mm -hmm. then, uh, sir, I have uh, I have also been working uh, knowledge in the data visualization tool like Tableau, where I have built report. Uh, build report. Uh, then uh, I have built dash dashboards and share with the uh, concern team as per their requirement. Uh, I have a good understanding in data governance also, uh, like data quality knowledge and uh, data governance. Uh, I have good knowledge in Python also, which includes uh, pandas, math, uh, then NumPy also. Okay, nice. Very good. It looks like you have a very rich experience. So tell me, you mentioned that you were working in HCL technology and you were dealing with the global stakeholder and customer, correct? What are the different countries Yes, sir. you were dealing with the stakeholder and you know global region manager? How many So, countries? uh, like What are Middle the country East, names? Yeah. uh, Middle East, and then Saudi, and the uh, APAC region, I have also dealt with them. Okay, apart in which country? Uh, so, Asia, so In USA, India and okay, India and Singapore. US. Also, you are reporting to US. Good, excellent. So you you mentioned that you have you know managing lot of data, correct? When you're dealing the Yes, sir. data, what sort of analysis you done in SQL? Yes, sir. So like uh, if uh, a data cleaning activity, Mm -hmm. In data cleaning uh, then uh, activities, yeah. what do you do exactly?
uh, uh, finding errors like uh, uh, if if some spaces or any errors will come, then uh, I used to remove them. Okay, so you are spending time for data cleaning activities, or removing space, yes, unwanted data, null value, finding you know any any invalid data is there. Good. Tell me, I, okay, this error. Why this error is coming to database? If the error is there, then how we can overcome? You know, what are the sort of a technology or your process is going to implement to resolving this issue? Uh, come again, sir. This, you know, you when you were telling data cleaning activities, you are spending extracting the data, using remove data, unwanted data, invalid data. Why this root uh, error is coming? I mean, who, where it is, you know, coming error? Understand the data uh, is already landed uh, in I... database, but why, why, where it is coming? Who, how it is generating the invalid data? So it is coming from the users. Which is your? Uh, sir, so, uh, all the data I am, uh, I am getting all the data from a specific team. Uh, mm -hmm. From those team, I get the data and I used to work on the uh, provided data. Okay, that many you are telling the end user that is coming from operational yes, sources, sir. that data is coming, okay, error is coming, correct? So that error yes, is sir. coming as you are also part of a SQL development team. Why you are not, you know, applying any sort of technology so that we can restrict the data? Have you ever implemented any any concept that? Uh, yes, sir. Which concept? So there are different, uh, like uh, we, I have used different functions. Okay. What are the functions? SQL functions. Use? What are the functions you use? So like aggregate, aggregate functions, like and scalar functions. Scalar functions. But my question was to stop the restrict the invalid data. In SQL, which concept we need to apply to restrict invalid data that is come end user? As you mentioned, that the data is coming from end user. As a, you are a data user, data management head, you need to apply the constant, you know, logic. What are the, which logic is that to stop invalid data that is coming from data, you know, end user? Any idea? I can give you hints. Oh, no, sir. Well, constant is a, yes. I think is a mechanism which is invalid, it restrict the, the data. Correct. Okay, no issue. So, what do you mean by data quality? So, uh, it ensures the, the proper kind of data which uh, is uh, required for our purpose uh, is present here. Okay, so you are improving data quality in database. What are the data quality dimensions? You know, the there are dimension. six types of... Mm -hmm. uh, yes, sir. There are five to six types of data quality dimensions like uh, accuracy, consistency, timeliness, completeness, uniqueness, and validity. Very nice. Any specific tool you are using to improving the data quality? Yeah, the logic you are applying into your data day-to-day -day activities. I was uh, um, applying the data in day-to-day uh, activities, data dimensions logic. Okay, very nice. Okay, so tell me in SQL, moving to SQL database, which SQL, uh, like which database you are using? Which branch of a database your company used? Microsoft SQL. Microsoft database. So Microsoft SQL Server. Why not Oracle? If you're comparing, there's many databases there. Oracle is there, you know, SQL Server, IBM is there. Why you you or your company choose or why you want to choose SQL Server? It's not compatible with uh, uh, everything that you... So you mean the SQL server is more user friendly and compatible and best fit yes. for data users. Okay. All right. Yes. 
what is SQL join and what other different types of join is there? The SQL joins, uh, like when we want to combine uh, different tables, like one or more table, uh, we use SQL joins. Uh, there are what... many types of joins, mm -hmm. uh, like inner join, outer join, uh, self join, uh, left join, and right join. What is the difference between left outer join and right outer join? The left outer join means uh, uh, when we use left outer join, we will get the data from all the data from the left table and uh, only the common data from the uh, which match the left table, we will get those data only. But when we talk about the right join, uh, then we will get all, all the data from right table and only the match data from left table. Okay. What is stored procedure? And what is the syntax for stored procedure? And why you are using stored procedure? Uh, a store procedure, uh, uh, so it is a uh, used temporarily. A uh, temporarily we used uh, to store like uh, previously we have done some queries or anything, and uh, like some other person came and he does not have any uh, technical knowledge or knowledge on. That. But uh, uh, we, uh, he or she can be able to access those. Okay. Do you have a pen paper with you? Yes, sir. Okay. Can you write a SQL syntax to remove permanently yes. a column from an existing table? The table name is customer and the move, uh, column you want to that column name is called city. What will be the syntax? Can you write or text me or you can, you know, in, in you can message me in that chat box. Okay. Can you repeat okay. column I you know now I want to delete a particular column from a table. That table name is the customer and column name is city. You can tell me syntax over here okay, also. No I problem. will text you. No, you can tell over here also. No issue. So just give me. Uh, yes, sir. alter table customer. Hello. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Alter table customer. Uh, and uh, delete. So come again. You want to so delete what a is the... yeah. permanently delete a column from a table. That column name is the city column. So alter table table name, drop column, column name. Correct. Column name. Yes. yes sir. Okay. No issue. Mm. So you you have a, a good exposure into Tableau data visualization. Yes, sir. What is show me in Tableau? Mm. Okay, no issue. I'm not recalling. No, no, no problem. What are the different that you know? Data, so data filter in Tableau. Uh, the the, there are four, four yeah. types of four types of uh, data filters are there. Mm -hmm. What are the names? A rows column, uh, uh, a rows column, then a uh, fil uh, filter. Mm -hmm. Okay, and what is the data blending in Tableau? So we are uh, when we are combining the data uh, data from uh, different source or uh, different columns. You are using data blending. What is the difference between data blending and SQL join? Uh, both are used for combining the data. But what is the difference? Uh, in joins, we uh, uh, we use both uh, like one or more table to combine data. Uh, but in Tableau, we can uh, combine uh, the data from different sources. Yeah, very good point. That is a point I'm expecting. Yes. Okay. All right. Excellent. Uh, 
you mentioned that you've done a project retail data management project correct what is that can you bit elaborate can you step down all the steps uh yes sir there uh, like uh, as i told you like uh, we are getting data from a different team so uh, after we get uh, those data uh, we used to filter them like as per the client requirement like uh, uh, we have to sort list uh, the data as per the requirement like sometimes they are uh, telling like uh, we have to sort uh, uh, the data according to their age or sometimes gender okay so uh, accordingly we need to uh, we are creating different sheets and we are uh, organizing those data okay nice so why you left hcl hcl is a good company you are dealing with a good job why you left why you put you know resign so hcl uh for better skills enhancement and uh, good opportunity uh like in order to i i want to enhance my skill set uh, and i was looking for a better opportunities as per my knowledge acl is you know continuously you know giving the good skills to the employee those who are even working those who are in bench they 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 have a team they constantly continuously giving the input providing in house training outside training they have a lot of uh, uh, you know uh, channel partner uh, certification is there you did not get a chance there yeah. and so definitely hcl is a very good company but as per my requirement uh i thought to enhance my skills uh, and i didn't find the perfect match there okay so what is your strength uh, uh so uh, i can say i am a quick learner and a great team player okay so how soon we can join in case we are offering our offer letter like uh so i can uh, join within a month within a month like 15 days or something okay good do you have any question to me i think i'm good uh yes sir uh, my question will be uh, if uh, everything goes well then when can i be able to join your company yeah definitely pratiksha uh, we are like you know the the few more round is there a few candidate also you you know taking the parallel interview and uh, yes uh, once you, in case your profile is shortlisted hr will get back there is a few more round will be there client round and hr round will be there okay make yes, sense sir. yeah all right yeah so all the best uh, pratiksha okay thanks thanks for joining have a good day thank you sir